This apparent contradiction between science and scripture, while scientists tell us that the human race has been on earth for at least 100,000 years, the Bible indicates God created Adam only about 6,000 years ago, begins to vanish when we read the Bible and find it does not refer to Adam as the first man in an absolute chronological sense. In fact, it only calls Adam the first man once. That's in 1 Corinthians 15, 45 through 47. But thereafter calling Adam the first man, it calls Jesus Christ the second man. So these verses are simply saying that since Adam came first and Jesus came second, Adam came before Christ and Christ came after Adam. This apparent contradiction completely disappears when we understand that Genesis chapter 1 tells us of God's creation of the human race, and its second chapter tells us of his much later creation of Adam and Eve. All questions on this way of understanding the scriptures are answered in this book.